A couple in Canada lost $140,000. They were just at home when suddenly the husband's phone just stopped working. No signal, no text, just SOS mode. Turns out, someone walked into a phone store, pretended to be him, and got a new SIM card. And just like that, the scammer hijacked his phone number and used it to access everything tied to it. Bank accounts, stock trading apps, crypto wallets, literally everything monetarily valuable. This is called SIM swapping, and it's more common than you think. Now, here's the part that could have changed everything. If just one of those finance apps had used Vonage's SIM swap API, they could have been alerted that the phone number for that SIM just got changed. That alone is a massive red flag. Instead of letting the scammer log in and drain all the accounts, the app could have paused all high-risk actions, like changing passwords or making bank transfers. The SIM swap API could have done this small check that could have saved them a much bigger check. I think one of the crazier parts of the story is that the phone company that gave this random person a new SIM card didn't even take accountability or pay that couple back. So a huge takeaway here is, if you're a developer creating apps for other people, make sure you include some sort of security measure because you could possibly prevent other people from losing their entire retirement funds and having to work for their entire lives. For more information on how you can make your apps more secure by using things like Vonage's SimSwap API, visit us at developer.vonage.com. Stay safe and happy coding.